Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. And today we're going to take a look at Lee Repkin's The Transbury Juice Piston Cup Racer number 63. And before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, Lee Repkin's is an Axello Vision stock car who raced in the Piston Cup for Transbury Juice and bore the number 63. He also attended the one of the I mean one of the racers that attended the Dynaco 400 at the Motor Speedway at the South at the 2005 Piston Cup season, and during the race, he got tapped out of the race by Chick Hicks, and and he wasn't seen again since the the rest of the race, and. That is it. So now let's get right into the review. Oh wait, almost forgot, forgot to mention that Lee Revkins was released as a launcher and with rubber tires and was re-released with as a single with, with plastic tires and in a two-pack with Chick Hicks. And now without any further ado, let's get right into the review. Here we've got his angry facial expression, num his headlights and a number 63 on one of them. And the on the hood, we've got the Transbury Juice logo with a bit of bubbles in the background. And on the left side, we've got a number 63, the exhaust pipes and the bubbles and juice in the background and the black rims on the Lightyear tires and several contingency sponsors saying Piston Cup, Nitrate, Revolting, Octane Gain, Mood Springs, Vitaline, No Stall, Gaskets, Gasprin, Easy Idle, RPM, Little Torquey Pistons, Leakless, Retread and Clutch Shade, and the Transbury Juice logo with the gas cap, and, and on the top we've got the number 63, more bubbles and no name signature, and, and we've got the yellow on the spoiler, and and on the back, we've got another Transbury Juice logo and the taillights and another number 63. And on the right side, similar design, but completely different. And that is it. And now, let's compare them to the other Axelo Fijon Piston Cup racers. We've got Matt Guycar, Daring Lightfoot, Chuck Armstrong, and Todd Marcus, and some of the other Piston Cup racers that share his body mold, like Rusty Cornfuel, who is a Brody Motor Co. Sparky GT, Aiken Axler, who is a Lux Motors Co. Piston Cup V8, Kevin Racing Tire, who is a Capital Motors Verve XT, and Ruby Easy Oaks, who is a Crown Celesta, and the other Axello vehicles. We've got Brick Yardley, who is a Vision EA, Cora Copper, who is a Rapido SI, and Manny McGear, who is a Microlux. And that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which Axello Vision Piston Cup Racer is your favorite? And which Nitro Wade Body Mold is your favorite? And which Axello Vehicle is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more and check out some of my other videos and consider the support by viewing my channel public publicly. I would really appreciate it very much. Oh, and also don't forget to leave a suggestion in the comments about which car of the past from the car collection video in the description should I review next. I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!